We'll do the intro again. Fine. Good day everyone, it's Ben here. Um, welcome to my second unboxing video. Uh, hope you enjoyed the first one. Uh, today, we're gonna be unboxing the two player uh, starter set from Bushido. Um, I've really been looking forward to these models. Um, I've been waiting a long time for them to come, uh, but good things come to those who wait. Uh, so let's crack into it and I'll uh, start unboxing. G'day everyone. Uh, welcome to my second unboxing video, which is gonna be the Bushido, the two player starter set. Um, this is actually a pretty heavy box, it's, and this uh, in this box we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten models. Uh, we did a faction review, or sorry, a, a, a review of the cards, and now we get to see the models in the flesh. I'm really excited for this. Um, <clears throat> I haven't opened it uh, because you know I thought why not do it all with you guys. So let's open my handy dandy knife that uh, a certain friend of mine gave me. For safety reasons, we put that down. And then um, let's go into oh bubble wrap. <laughs> let's go into it. So first things first. Okay, the majority of the weight is the is the book. So we got the cards. Cool. Uh, we've got a oh hang on, I'll go in that in a second. All right, so we've got an A5 rule book. And judging from it, it's just got just some new artwork, but that's about it. I haven't, everything else seems pretty normal. But yeah, that's good to have. What else have we got here? We've got a... Oh, token set. Oh, my lordy lord. Um, that's really, really cool. Um, I was not aware that they had that. That is really, really cool. All right. Token set. I'm going to be having to pop that out later. Um, right, and then what else have we got? Oh, a little information about, oh, a little scan me. If you guys want to scan with your phones, you can scan that if you want, I don't mind. Um, how to play, basic rules, yeah. Um, this is really, really cool. Especially for those who are learning to play. Okay. Bases. These are the beveled bases. You've got a whole bunch of 32. you got one 50 mil base here too. Bases, Psh. look at me, just, I'm stalling, stalling for you guys. All right, that's open. That's it, that can go away. Another, a box within a box. Oh, okay, so I was mistaken. So, I heard a rumor that they, these, ooh, packaging foam snacks. All right, so I had heard that these are metal, some of these are metal moles and some of these are, were um, not, they're all injected plastic. Okay, all right, all right, gonna, uh, let's go. All right, Teo, let's have a look at Teo. Wow, that is really intricate detail. A little bit of, a little bit of flashing, but it's not so bad. But no, he's great. I love that. I love that. Um, I love the detail <clears throat> on his um, backpack, his equipment, and this and the detail on the uh, the face of the model. Just really, really brilliant. And um, the robes are amazing. So I'll put him down. Okay, now we got Ma. Ma ha. All right. So, two part model. Firstly, let's look into the body of the uh, of this one. Look at those robes. It's going to be so cool to paint. I'm going to have a lot of fun with that. All right. And that's how Maha goes together. Oh, sorry. And that's how Maha goes together, but look at the ghosts. All right. So, so this is the ghost, uh, this is Maha, this is two of two. So um, there's some just intricate, as you can see, there is just a bit of flashing here and there. So I'm gonna have to go in there with like a little knife and just scrape all that out before I, I spray paint this model. 
But those, those ghosts are amazing. It's very pretty, very beautiful model. And that's our Maha ghost together. Just look. Wow. That's gonna look awesome. Okay, cool. All right. Ah, uh, Dahanji. Oh my God, he's a simple model, but he's so cool. Wow. Simple, stoic pose. Love it. All right. So that's three members of um, the Hitachi Hirochi family. Let's go. What else have we got? Okay. All right. So now we're going into. Oh, wow, she's really, wow. Okay, so we got Sadaka. That is going to be real, that's really fragile. Like really, really fragile. I'm, I'm, I did those three like doing doings and I'm, I'm already terrified that's going to break. But wow. But I mean, I mean, if that's the best, worst thing, why not just do this just to make. All right, sorry, but okay, that's her bit there. But look at that detail on her, on her, on her robes. Can the camera pick it up? Oh, there we go. She's got a little bit of flashing. Yep, just you know, I'm gonna have to give these guys a wash and everything. But those robes are amazing. Ah, uh, okay, all right. So the pole's gonna be reinforced. Cool, cool, cool. Sorry. So there is a line here. <laughs> pointing with the pole. Yeah. Um, so there is a line here in the body, um, which means the pole's going to be enforced, reinforced. So, but because her hand is so dainty, it's going to be tricky, but look, I'm going to have to give that, I mean, that's probably the worst part of, so from what I've opened up so far. All right. Next member. Haboku. Oh my God. This guy, this guy's amazing. Just the detail on him is just fantastic. Oh my god! Like he's you got you can see the scowls in his face. Like like the detail in his face is amazing. GCT, you knocked it out of the park. Look at the detail on the um on the katanas. Just the, on the hilts. That's amazing. There we go. Oh, there we go. Wow. Look at that. Amazing. Amazing view. Wow, that's an amazing model. Okay, um, really like Haboku. All right. Kimani. Wow, she's amazing too. The detail, like the, like on the, on the wrapping on her sort of like robes here. Amazing. Lovely robes. I mean, these guys are all great. Kamina. Kamina, I should say, sorry. No. Kamina, her detail is amazing. The robes. I love her stoic pose as well. All right. <clears throat> so let's bring out the next ones. Oh, all right. Well, I'm going to, I'm going to leave the fox to the last because, oh, wow. Ko Koga. Wow. Holy hell. He is one. Well, now I can see why she betrayed her family. Because, wow, forbidden love. He is handsome. <laughs> um, yeah, just a bit. Just a bit of flashing, but it's not so bad. But wow, wow, wow. Look at that. Amazing. Amazing. So good. He is probably... Wow, he's an amazing model. Okay. Oh, get rid of this plastic bin. You look unprofessional. Okay. All right, so. Kicho. Oh, wow, she's amazing. All right. She's a little bit wobbly in terms of, like, the katanas are a little bit bendy, as you can see. But wow, look at that detail. Yeah, this is definitely, definitely, definitely one of my favorite models. The hair. The hair looks amazing. GC Studios, you guys. Terrific. Amazing. All right. 
put those down. Let's bring you over there. All right. Hinadori. Wow. Okay. Um. Wow. All right. Let me just see if I can. That flew across the room. <laughs> wow. All right. Oh, whoa. Guys, this is amazing. I'm so glad they did this in, um, in, in, um, in this material, not metal because metal that would all be, well, one should be incredibly heavy and two, like just the de you wouldn't get the detail on this. So, I mean, wow, that's amazing. Okay. All right. Right. I can't. Rio Keen, Rio Keen, sorry, Rio Keen one of two. So you got the long fur of the long tail, sort of like of the fox body. Just gonna push that away. That's a that's a really really good. The fur, like nothing here is like that's just a bit of flashing, it's not, but like the fur along here is amazing. Really, 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 really pretty. Let's go to the second part. So the second part of the body, you can see like the rib cage. And the, um, the flowing fur on the, on the feet. It's really awesome as well. And the head. All right, the ears are a little bit flimsy, but I mean, it's such a lovely model. Well, if I didn't have this ray of beam coming through. Intricate detail all along here too. Really, really nice. Wow. That's amazing. Right. Now, normally, I like, like I did in the Void mo uh, model miniature, I put the models together and somewhat and sort of stand them up, but it... Oh, you're right. Fuck. I'm just going to do it I'm, for you guys. Normally I would watch these and I would you know, give them a good little presentation, but no, you, you, the viewer deserve a treat. I, I had heard that these, some had said that these were going to be metal. Some parts were going to be metal and some parts were not. So that's really interesting. I mean, one, I'm really, I mean, I, I don't mind. I don't mind them all being um resin but i that's what i was under the impression of okay let's tell you what give me a couple of minutes guys and what i'll do is i am going to get some close-up videos of these for you <laughs> Okay, cool. Um, so now we'll just go through the cards. We've got uh, enhancement, event, 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 enhancement, 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 event. Okay, one, two, three. Enhancement cards. One, two, three, four, five. Five. One, two, three, four. Oh, here we go. Wow, the artwork is really, really good on these. Yeah. Cards, all the cards are there. Now what we'll do is we'll uh, come down and have a better view, a closer up view of the guys. All right guys, now we're just getting a bit of a closer look at all of the models. And 
And there's young Juliet and Romeo. And now we're going into the other family. Um, this is Mayha is probably, I reckon, the hardest model to put because if you don't get that um, arm placement right, it really stuffs you about. Um, perfect one part model, two pieces model, and Teo, and the fox. The fox was a little bit tricky, um, but that's because there's this peg that's in the head, right? Which, if you don't remove it all, it, it affects the body placement. And then obviously I've, just, I've got my, my two bears. Um, Zappa Gap, please, please sponsor me. I love your, I love your product so much. Um, so initial thoughts on these guys. Um, I love the amount of detail. Um, norm, okay. The rest of my, my, my army and stuff, I, but all my models, sorry, are all metal. So that's just going to take a little bit of getting used to. But reality is, is, the, the reality is the sheer amount of details on these models is worth it. Like I, I'm looking at the, um, the, like the lightning on her and it's just, it's incredible. Oh, the flames on the magical flames is amazing. Um, uh, Coda's armor is amazing. Everybody's robes are just fantastic. The details, the little details make it. Um, I'm just going to, yeah. I'm going to take my time and enjoy painting these models. Um, I think they're amazing. Um, so we'll uh, come back to me and yeah. <laughs> Thanks for enjoying taking part in the, the unboxing video. Uh, actually, hold on. Right. So everything here is what comes in here. We've got the cards. We've got the uh, tokens. We've got the mini rule book and we've got all the models there we come in the starter box set. So that was the, um, the models. Um, so my, Initial thoughts is uh, the detail is amazing. Um, Thank you very much for checking out this video. If you're enjoying the content of this channel, please like and subscribe. If you're in a position to do so, please check out patreon.com slash getting tabled. You receive early access to at least 80% of all videos that we put out. And you get access to the video edition of all of our podcasts the day that they're uploaded. If you'd like to check us out on social media, Facebook.com slash getting tabled is the most active. We also have a Discord server. You can email our team at gettingtabled at gmail.com. If you're on either Twitter or Instagram, you can find us at getting tabled. And until next time, play more games. Hey buddy, how you going? Yeah, I know, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know, Hankel. There's miniatures. <laughs> we could keep that in as, as a bit of a gag, but yeah. All right, let's go back. So 